girl has so a bunch much, of dick, right? So much vagina. No, coming at you, coming at you. No, just no, 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 no. All no, sides. I know, I know. I'm. I'm. I'm it's, it's all just, sides. It's just dicks everywhere. Or vagina everywhere. behind you, <laughs> under you. This is less than zero. Less than zero. I want to put everything <laughs> that you don't want recorded, recorded, and put out there as quickly oh, as possible. Well, I'm ready to go. My I'm work. recording for an hour already. Yeah. Dang. Okay. Uh, okay. Where are we at? Episode 37? 37? Already? Really? Sounds yes. right. Yeah, 37. Episode 37, uh, 2021, the happy new year, the new year's edition of the podcast. Hey. 2021. Yes. We made it alive, guys. We made, made it alive. Made it alive. Less than zero podcast. I'm Julian, Vicky, uh, Justo behind the lens, and then- Niall is a part of the show. I just want to just want to put God. that out there. Swear, Niall is here. Swear, I'm dying for Niall to get here because I want to talk to him about that movie Soul, and I know he has <gasps> strong opinions about it's it. It's good. I, you wa- I, you watched it? I watched it I over in years. I love Soul. It I was cried. great, and I know he has opinions Bro, on it. And I'm I, dying to debate with him. About I it. cried. <laughs> I cried. Wait, you guys have? I was going to ask. You guys have Disney Plus? Yes. Yeah. Give me the damn access. <laughs> I'll trade you. I'll give you. And it's five dollars. No. D- what do you mean? Give, I'll give you Hulu. I'll give you Hulu for Disney Plus. Just I got for like, Hulu I have already. Hulu. I, I have Hulu and Netflix. Yeah. Same. I hate I you guys. It. Just to watch the movie. Hell yeah. <laughs> so that's a no. I'll give it to you later. Thank you. Fine. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> we'll put it on the link below. All right. Um, Next episode, we'll talk about Soul because I want I want Niall to be here to talk about it. Okay. Is Niall, Niall's going to be here? Yes. He better Niall, be. I hope you're here. He yeah. Just be. real quick, I just want to say he texted me saying he's going to spend one more day in Arizona with uh, the fiance. So anyway. Good for him. Okay. We will. Not his fiance. His wife. His duh. wife. They've been married. His fiance. Um, I'll so, allow it. I'll <laughs> allow it. So next weekend. <laughs> um, we, Let's go around the room like we always do. Uh, as quick as possible, let's talk about the highlight from our holidays, from our New Year's, from our Christmas, whatever. Uh, ladies first. Justo? Ladies first. Oh. I mean, Vicky. <laughs> <laughs> you got me. Um, Kidder, he's a kid. I'm just kidding. <laughs> so uh, Christmas, I spent it with my fam, Bam. Okay. As you should. And you guys got into an <laughs> argument. What was it about? I know. Um, <laughs> you see what I'm trying to do? No, we didn't. We didn't get into an argument. Um, New Year's. We did. Officer drunk, drunk shit. The thing is, I don't remember. Fun. <laughs> Hell yeah. So it was a drunk, hold on. It was a drunk argument. Yeah. Like, you know, like in a fun like way, a bad debate, way. Like a, de- just debating. A debating. Just it was debating. a, it was a. In disagreements, you know? Yeah. It's, you know, I've all yeah, been there. It's okay. Nothing worse than a drunk argument though. Man. Cause then like things get said, you shouldn't have said that. That's in my experience. Uh, yeah. Yeah. It's okay though. <laughs> <You're> like, <"What?" laughs> How about. Look, this, the way that I saw it was it. Technically it was still 2020. Yeah, <laughs> so we you can say whatever you, you know, want to say. So 2021, you all that starting new slate, everything gets left behind. Did you <laughs> did you miss like old New Year's or were you like, because I assume you just kind of kicked it, right? Yeah, no. Did you miss new, old, like going out somewhere, seeing fireworks, doing the no. whole thing? No. I actually enjoyed being home. It was Good. nice. I was going to say the new version of going out. I mean, we do go out every night. You do know that, right? Where are you going? No, I'm just saying. Meet, <laughs> to to uh, Dunkin' Donuts? No, meet us at Clubhouse. Oh, Clubhouse. Demon oh time. <laughs> yeah. I mean, there's a lot of different There's a lot of different rooms in the Clubhouse. You know what I'm saying? It's so free. So many rooms. It's free. I'm just saying that's it's 2021. Free. Am I right? And I got yeah, VIP yeah, access. Thanks to Vicky. Appreciate it. Thank you. Um, You're welcome. <laughs> You're welcome. Vicky, I know, I've, I've like I've noticed there's a hell of people I've let in. Yeah. So like sometimes more I'll more go and follow. I'm like, oh shit! I got they nominated by me. <laughs> oh me! Oh that's me. I will say that that app is look. Any app is gonna be toxic if you spend a lot of time on it. That's all I'm gonna say. Uh huh. Because dude, I see You're some obsessed of the, with it, huh? And they're adding no. more, they're adding more things to it too. Like now they um they yes. added like a category list. Yep. yep. Now yep, you dude. can really. I'm like, well, this is okay. I like That's this. one thing I noticed. Like, if you wanted like a specific subject, it would be hard to find something. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You would just it's just a bunch of stuff in a big pile. Yeah. But now it's a little bit better. Well, here's the thing with Clubhouse, real quick. Um, I was gonna talk about it later, but it's like you notice like the only thing with it is that if you spend a lot of time on it, like I was saying, there's a lot of people I I recognize. It's like seeing the same guy at the club every single weekend. If you're spending all your time listening and gaining gaining all this knowledge or just having all this conversation, what are you doing? Like it's taking away from your time of actually living your yeah, life. That's true. Hey, that's what soul was about. I mean, about. there's people, there's people. Oh my God. Oh yes. my God. Don't tell Honestly, me about it. Please. Watch after it, watching, though. after watching that. Watch it by it next really week. Made, we'll it, like, it really made me like think about life. Man, I hate you guys, man. Because you guys are telling me how good it is. And you know, I like, I like watching movies. It's a good movie. Like seriously, I cried. I did uh, cry. I, I almost know. cried twice. Wait, did you cry more to that or the new Justin Bieber video? 
I didn't even cry to the Justin Bieber movie. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Uh, how Are about, we talking about not? the previous one? No, talking I'm talking about the one that anyone, just dropped. Anyone. The Rocky no. one? No. no. The, the previous the, the previous one, which one was that one? Holy? Yes. Was it Holy? Was it Holy? No. The one where they were homeless? The one where it was his uh, self on a on a stage? Uh, lonely. 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 Was it Lonely? Yeah, Lonely. Lonely. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, that's beautiful. Um, that's what it sounded like. It. Okay, so just so highlight. Like a highlight. It was like a hard yodel. We're going to get to Justin Bieber. <laughs> highlight for you. My house almost caught on fire. Ooh. What? Not my house. My wife's family house. Because we did Christmas outside, right? So we had a couple. It wasn't a lot of people. And we all social distanced. We were outside, right? And we have one of those like tarps so that we're all under a tarp because uh-huh. it was cold. And then we also had like this bonfire thing. So we had the bonfire out and we we're like, but it was outside of the tent. So we we're like, oh, it's, we don't feel the heat. We're going to bring the bonfire underneath the tent oh jesus yeah that was it that's a fail <laughs> and we put and my wife's grandpa put an extra log in there so that shit the started fire just started fucking, escalating it blew up smoke oh filled the whole God. tent and like and, and like the way the thing was like you couldn't there was no handles on the bonfire thing so you couldn't just like pick it up and move it we yeah. couldn't grab it to What'd move it do? Oh we God. got like a shovel and we like pushed it out <laughs> oh, okay because the first thing you're supposed to do is like throw a blanket onto like fires or something they like that? threw a metal chair on top which didn't do anything oh, i don't know that a works. metal chair yeah. oh my i'll God. show you guys I a video just, so hold on did it did it catch fire onto the tent is it that- almost did but it didn't oh that's good yeah we were able to get it away before it got like really big but it was probably if we any longer it probably would have caught that's wow, scary. you guys had very interesting. Um, but it was okay. It just, it just smoked out the whole fucking thing. <laughs> oh, I also went to LA. I hell forgot. You went to LA? You, you, Yo, is LA as shut down and as bad as people make it make it out to be? People are saying like there's like encampments everywhere, more homeless, more than ever. People are just making out like it is complete like like chaos over there. True or um, no? Um, I mean, I didn't really get the chance to explore out there. But um, the hotel that I stayed at, like every restaurant was closed. Where'd you eat at then? Where'd you go eat? There, there was a subway open. Nice. <laughs> Coca Combos are like, good. Like I wasn't. Ma- I, honestly, I wasn't mad because I, like I like Subway. Sometimes Subway hits. Oh sometimes. my god. Hella bad. I'll eat a Subway. Mm-hmm. That's a good junk food too. You went to LA for what? Uh, record some music. Nice. Record like in a studio or to mm-hmm. do like a music video? Record no oh. at the studio. Ooh, cool man. Did yeah. it? Did it go good? It did. It did. I. I um. Got to record two songs and then two whole songs, two whole songs. And That's then um, I'm actually going back on the 15th and I'm recording. I'm going to finish recording my album. Dumb, dumb question. You you go there because obviously the producers are there. Right. Yes. <laughs> okay, I'm just asking. I mean, I'm still I'm, I'm still making connections out there. But uh, um, yeah, I'm actually um, like why L.A. Uh, I'm working with Derek King. Oh, okay. Oh, he's, he's there, guys. That's why. Yeah. So you're telling me you can't tell him to come to you? <laughs> yeah. Like, nah, uh, just funny. Kidding. What you're are you talking to... about? He came out here for my music video? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm just kidding. Yeah, right, right, right. Make sure y'all go watch that on my IGTV. Yeah. Dropping on YouTube very soon. For sure. We, we, we definitely <laughs> got to talk about the music thing. Ad. <laughs> hey, dude, remind me to talk about the music thing because I just, I, I want to correlate that with the whole like Russ interview and stuff like that. I just think Word. there's like very similar like stories there. You know what I mean? Um, I'll keep it really quick. Mine was really boring. I just, um, I'm getting used to the whole schedule of like tracking these radio stations. So it's a, like, it's a new schedule for me trying to like build a schedule. And uh, I, I don't like really staying at home, to be honest with you. I, I actually hate it. So it's boring for me to sit in front of a computer and like track and, you know. I bet. You know yeah. what I mean? Like you're I just. Bet you hate it. Like I like the radio part, but actually <laughs> you're such just. A, you're such a social butterfly. So being trapped being inside. No, I mean it. Yeah. You're a very social butterfly. Yeah, dude. Like I, I mean it. I feel like a lion that's been right. locked in his cage. I hate. I agree. Like, I don't like being at home. I like talking to people. But exactly. I mean, you got to do the work, man. So, you know, so I just get used to the new schedule of just doing these radio stations. Question. Yeah. Have you gotten anything back from that job? Didi, Texas? No. Oh, no. But then. Okay. I was just, I, was, I just I know. <laughs> my head right now. Like, oh, my God. People are saying, I mean, I don't know. I call it gra- like I call it a reach. Because you figure, like, last time I talked to the the PD was on the 18th, 19th, something like that. Mm-hmm. I, I have it all, like, written down. And he said he'll get back to me, something like that. And that was 18th, 19th. My other friends are saying, well, it's the holidays. The holidays hit after that. Yeah. Is that, Vicky, Justo, is that That's a valid true. excuse? Yeah, it is. Yeah, the holidays. Okay. Guys, I done, no, guys, it does. I haven't it done does. shit in two the, weeks. The pandemic has really, like, made a switch up on a lot of shit. Vicky, he said that he, they would ideally like to have someone in place in February. 
Okay. Meaning the move has to happen by February. Meaning deals have to be done or any a, any details need to be all hashed out in early January or mid January. Well, it just became January. Okay. Like it literally just literally became it's, January. It's, it's like, like my third day out here. Right. Facts. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Keep hope I mean, alive. Keep Julian. hope. Keep hope. All you little social hopeful. butterfly. <laughs> I just social butterfly. It's like talking to people. It's like annoying people, man. That's what it is. By yeah. the way, complex media. Before I before I stop, I don't know if you care, but if you ever you you, you see how complex media has like different like personalities and news anchors and stuff. Uh -huh. They're looking for someone. Oh really? And Ooh. I'm I'm gonna go. You should go for it too. Really? Well, because you're making videos all the time on TikTok. You do it. Dude, Vicky. <laughs> well, I mean, look, what are we doing right now? We're 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 taping stuff, right? <laughs> Tell me more about how good I would be at it. Vicky, 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 Vicky. I want everyone to win, man. You know what I mean? 60 seconds. They only ask 60 seconds. Just tell us who you are. You can do that. You do that shit anyway. I'm gonna do it. Boop boop. Do it. Just Miss so? Vicky, bitch. <laughs> boom. Perfect. Check out my music, all my streaming platforms. Mic drop. Just thought I'd share. Boom, boom. All right. <laughs> all right, so let's talk about Justin Bieber's New Year's Eve performance and this new video that dropped. Anyone? Like how I did that? Anyone? I don't know why I did that. Um, did, did anyone see the New Year's Day performance? Anything? I didn't watch yeah, it. I watched it. You did? did you watch I it? did. The whole good. thing? I watched it, yeah. It was good. good. It actually was pretty good. So was okay. it you know, a perform? I, was it like a concert? Or is it like a... Yeah, it was like a concert. Oh, okay. It was at a hotel in like... was in like I assume, I assume it was in LA, in Beverly Hills or something. Yeah, it was It was at a... Uh, what? No. It was at a fancy hotel. Yeah. We'll just say that. Really we do our research. But, um, um, yeah, no, it was good. I liked it. The so DJ was it, played good music too in the beginning. I was like, oh. So like something like that, that's because it was like a couple hours, right? Into the new year? No, it wasn't that long. Mm, no. Or was Honestly, it just he half? Start, he, I think he performed about two songs and then he was like, oh, we got about two <laughs> minutes left. Uh huh. Can I have my crew come out? And then like, uh -huh. dude, he cracked me up because he popped the bottle. Yeah, you see, I saw that. Happy New Year's! Woo! Pop the bottle. And then, nice. right, he's about to go back into it. But then he goes, oh, the floor is wet. I didn't really think this through. Uh, Do we got a towel in here? I like, I like the whole... That's hella funny. It was hella funny. It was a very casual vibe. Do you mm -hmm. notice that? Like, it seemed Good. like, you know, he was, he was talking about how, oh, man, I'm thirsty. Can I get some water? It was just very... It wasn't like... It wasn't like a, a stereotypical perfect concert, which is yeah. kind of cool. But here's what's... You didn't see this, Vicky, because you saw it after, right? Yeah. The actual live stream, Justo. Yeah. For, I feel bad for anyone that paid for it. I'm sorry. <laughs> the, the stream was, yo, it didn't work for a yeah. lot of us. You couldn't get in. Like trying to get into a concert, we couldn't get through the doors. Bummer. I couldn't get in. Just technical difficulties? Yes. Bummer. And I and That's that really sad. pissed me the hell off. For the people that actually paid for it, I would have been, you should, they should be getting refunds. So I had to watch it off a of stream. Mm -hmm. I had to watch it off a of stream and it was really shaky. Um, but for one, what I saw... Um, yeah, it was cool. I mean, I, I don't like the fact that he didn't perform. Like a lot of these songs, like Baby, he didn't do the whole, he didn't do the whole song. Why do people do that? Nah, he never yes, does he the whole did. song. Yes, he did. What are you talking about? Baby, from the beginning to the end? Yeah, he even no. played Ludacris's part. What are you talking about? <laughs> Am I wrong? I felt like he didn't. Because he even rapped it. No, I, f I, I heard the rap. I felt like he, <laughs> I wanna, I wanna, no, Mickey, I felt like he shortened it up. I don't think so. I think he played the whole song. Can you let us know in the comments? Maybe I'm like delusional, but I'm pretty sure we'll he played the whole song. I bet we can watch it back later. Yeah. And they usually tr they'll probably trim the beginning. And I don't end like a the bit. trimming for th those songs. Those songs I really like. Well, that's that the song songs. that really made him blow up. Yeah, like, you know that's re that's one that song went diamond, I believe. Yeah. Wow. Now let me so ask you. I, like, it's crazy. He still plays it. To be honest, why Hell do you? Yeah, I can <laughs> shit. And if my song went diamond, I'd be like, I'll forever play that song for you guys. Vicky, why do you think he didn't? Any concert. Vicky, Any. Why, why do you think he didn't do one time and one less lonely girl? Which earned more hits when he was on the come up. Uh, because I think majority of the time, like artists tend to play their biggest, biggest songs off each album, which is like maybe mm. one out of each song. I mean, yeah, out of each album. Each album. That's usually mm. what they do. I have. I don't think I like watching different artists. I don't think I've ever seen another artist play like two songs off. Another but album. it's nostalgic. So that's, so that's the strategy. I've always wondered that how artists choose their set lists. Like yeah, that. they usually yeah they usually just pick the biggest song that really and got like, from that out from that album because a lot of the time that's the only song that people are really gonna remember. There's a couple. And they're gonna get more excited about it and the, all you want is the art like the fans yeah. To get there's a couple artists where like I've seen them multiple times and like there's one or two songs mm -hmm. that like I'm dying to hear them play but they never play it just because it wasn't their like mm -hmm. number one. Could song. it also be that they want you to remember or they want you they want to push their newer music the oh, current course. music yeah. right and they have a big catalog of that mm -hmm. so i get that um is it just me but i felt like did he just roll out of bed 
He always looks like <laughs> he that. He always looks like he that. No, 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 no. He did. He did. He did. Vicky, how like, is he dressed? He, Yo. Tell him. He was like in like a hoodie and some jeans, like Bro. hair. Dad jeans. Dad jeans. Dad jeans. <laughs> he he played for. He was cool though. I was like, dude, that that's how I want to like be when that's I'm how on you stage. Just roll just, out of bed, just chilling like on I'm the stage. Look what I'm wearing. No, I, I, but wanna, I don't know I if like that was good, planned. No, I think he really just I got s- out of bed. When he, <laughs> no, when I don't he, think so. When, now, when 997, we have our concert, when we used to, pre pandemic, mm-hmm. had our big concert every year. Justin mm-hmm. Bieber was in it one year. Same thing. He was literally laying down in his green room. You saw him? And he was, I didn't see him, oh. but I, he was chilling. And then it was time he literally just got up and walked out and that was it. So like he literally just rolls out of bed I don't give a, I don't and give a jumps shit. on stage. He doesn't give a shit. And he does his little dances. Yeah. Uh, you you notice it. he does the, what do you call those? He does like very, he's not like a heavy dancer like Chris Brown, but he very does like subtle. Yeah, very moves. subtle. What, it's what is that called? I think it's silly. <laughs> you, you get what I'm saying? He'll do like quick like pop locks and yeah. Uh-huh. That. But he Here's doesn't that. do like the full. Freestyles? Yeah, he doesn't do like full, like something fully like on his own. He's not like um. He's definitely not like a Chris Brown. He does like little accents. I call them accent pieces. Yeah, I agree. But then you know what? I also with feel- the background dancers around him, yeah, 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 like yeah. going whole I know. hard yes, with yes, it. Yes, they're doing the but job. He does like a little bit of the move, but then do like a full like. Well, thing. the thing is, it's like you also have to remember he hasn't performed in about three what three four years. Yeah. Now, nah, but he did that when I watched him and he was doing to- when he was touring. He did the same thing. No, like. yeah. But also, you also have to remember that, like, if you go full, full out like that. It, it exhausts uh, you. Yeah. And, it, you know, you're going to when you're singing, you're going to be like. Ah. Hey, hold on. You, know, Vicky, you, you act like he's 50. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you never know. You never know. Sometimes I may fucking lose my breath when I'm performing. And I'm like, damn. I but like, isn't that, isn't that like, part of what you want to see an artist? Them go their whole heart every of time. Of course, you see of course. But you're not going to see them like doing the whole I, dance. After, I saw. Like, I saw. I mean, I don't know. I saw I, Tyler the Creator live twice. I've seen him before, and like he goes fucking ham every single time. When the through, first time I saw him, whole, he was okay. But throughout through the, the whole, whole thing, thing, through the whole thing, he's he will going do a whole hard. dance. He's sweating so. balls song, by the end okay, of it. Okay, so a song's three minutes long, and you're gonna see him perform the whole three minutes dancing nonstop while he's perf- while he's. Just on the so. mic? Have just, you seen Tyler? Uh, just, I have not. Just I have not. Bro, I gotta to watch, watch then. Just to watch he's him not do doing show. organized dancing. He's doing no, stage he's, dives. He's just he's running doing, around. He's, he's not doing anything oh. like synchronized. He's no, doing but like, he's constantly moving. Period. And he's jumping. But it's, and di- doing it's different shit. than it's different than different. actually doing some choreography. Right. Like choreography is a whole ass level. Like a whole different level. A whole other thing. Like a whole other thing. Yeah. Instead of because there's timing involved. Yeah. You yeah. know, like, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Not trying to knock it. Not yeah. trying to knock it. Cause, like, I, I feel I, it. I get that there, there should be a balance of, like, not exhausting yourself. But I think from, like, uh, from, like, a fan's perspective, you want to see your artist mm-hmm. do everything. I mean, think about it. Look, show. somebody that I really enjoy. If I was a, if I was like a diehard Bieber fan, when I saw him live, I'd be like, that was it. I felt that was, like, not a great show. Well, I think show he doesn't. Hold on. Like, I think he does enough. I think he does enough. There's enough going off on stage. Just, to, just enough. That's I, just feel, I, mean. I feel like he could have done better, but I don't knock it because he hasn't performed in three years. That's that, the way I, that's, that's how, that's my mind. It's like, dude, you haven't been on a stage in like how long, whatever. You're still coming on here. Your mm. voice is well, still cool. Not as mm. I would have thought one last know, thing. it would be, but. One last thing before we talk about his <laughs> video. All right, that's voice. Cool. Um, I did not notice this. I didn't notice this at all. And personally, I don't care. But your thoughts. Uh, some of the people were going in on him saying he forgot some of the lyrics. I like can sorry. He did. <laughs> did he? I, he did. I, I didn't, yeah, I didn't he notice did. it. No, he, did, he even said it. He goes, oh, I forgot. He goes, oh, I don't even remember some of Yeah, he lyrics. said he might forget. That's so funny. No, no. There was, there was one where he was in the middle of perform. He goes, oh, I didn't remember my oh, lyrics. Okay. And like he, I <laughs> mean, true. Funny, I, uh, I think it's funny. Hey, that's what I was going to say. Like, you know what? I'm not going to lie. That's happened to me before. And like, if if you're, uh, if I saw that, I didn't see it. But like, if you admit it and you're like, shit, I forgot my song. And like, you make a joke out of it, then it's fun. Yeah. Because you're a human and your fans see like, like oh, you forgot. That's funny. It's okay. And it happens. It's a, yeah. It's a, I, it's a I forgot. I forgot my own lyrics before. Yeah. I'd be happens. like, oh. There's a lot of words. Let me, <laughs> I'll say something else. I'm like, just yeah. kidding. So, okay. So what about the video? Man. Anyone, anyone dropped uh, by the time this video drops, it'll be a couple days old. But anyway, so anyone dropped on, well, uh, when did it drop? I don't know. Uh, <laughs> it dropped on New Year's Eve. It dropped on New Year's Eve. <laughs> like, I don't know. I just, so, I just, I don't know. So I know. well over a week ago, something Facts. like that. <laughs> First thoughts, man. Obviously it's a playoff Rocky, the movie. Yeah. Rocky. Yep. Adrian. Adrian. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, I like, I mean, I like, I liked it. She paused. Yeah. I liked it. It was all right. 
I like it. It was all right. I wonder why they covered his tattoos. You notice that? Oh, because Rocky doesn't have any tattoos. Is that why? Oh, that's why I'm, huh? I'm thinking. Think and also, and, tattoos. and I'm, I'm taking a guess and saying it probably takes away from the actual video and the actual message. I guess so. I don't think he would have. It For me, it was distracting. I was like, wait, why? Because well, if he just had his tattoos. Rocky didn't have any tattoos. Yeah, but he also didn't look like Rocky. He was just boxing. Well, but you can't change. He can't change the way he looks. Yeah, but like, I apparently he can. He covered his tattoos. He could have looked like Rocky a little but bit But you get what I'm saying. There's only so much he can do as far as like. I guess so. Now, let I'm me I'm curious ask, why they went through the effort to cover his tattoos. <laughs> do you think. I'm just. This is just conversation. But again, look, I like Rocky. I grew up on that stuff, so it I was emotionally attached to it. But do you think like do you think this is like real Bieber? Or you think he's using these these what you call these strategic plays just to sell more music? What I'm saying is, do you really think this is Bieber? Do you do you think like Bieber said, you know what, man? This song means so much to me. I want to create a story. You know what? I'm gonna think Rocky. Or do you think like someone <laughs> so someone shoved this down his throat and said, you know what? You should really Get, you're going to get the respect if you take the Rocky theme and you pretend to be Rocky. The girl in the video is going to be your Adrienne and you're going to, you know, you're going to play this role. I mean, when you think about, I mean, look, the music. You see what I'm saying? That, yeah. He's always made love songs. And the thing is, yeah, I but feel he's like changed, now. Yeah, he's changed, man. He is changed. That's what I'm saying. And I feel like now he wants, <laughs> he wants to create, like he wants to create something that is relatable to it. So I can see why he went with Do you that. think he does or his management around him I'll does? I'll tell you exactly. You see what I'm saying? I'll tell you exactly what happened. He walked into a meeting. There's a long table, bunch of dudes in suits. Bieber sits down. He's like, all right, what's the video going to be? This team goes up and they go, all right, you're going to be Rocky. And the whole video is you're going to be Rocky. Bieber's like, all right, cool. And then that's it. You honestly think that's how it happened. You think that it was shoved down his throat. You don't think that there's any sense of like transparency or growth in Bieber to think that maybe he wants to take this step in his career. Not when it came to deciding what the the video theme or what the video was going to be about. Nah, I don't think so. Okay. I think a corporate guy said, all right, well, or whoever the director is, whoever's in charge of the music videos, they're like, all right, we're going to do Rocky. I That's think I, I think he's in the growth stage, but I agree with you. I don't think he necessarily said, you know what? Let's go the Rocky. Let's go the Rocky. Bieber route. isn't like a huge Rocky fan. He was dying to make a video inspired by Rocky. I just don't think he's that deep. I mean, do you, <laughs> you know? know? You don't know that. Maybe I mean, he is. Yeah, maybe but he really likes Rocky. Well, and maybe he was like, fuck. I know he boxes. Perfect. But you know, I mean, I don't know. I don't know. At the end of the day, maybe we, he does. We, we will never know. <laughs> Unless we ask him. I, th <laughs> I think he has good intentions, but I think you're right. Maybe. I think that he has. He does actually box, though. There's videos of him like learning to box right. and do martial arts. But I'm going to go with what you. I think that he has a team, obviously, and they're helping him with the growth of his next next phase in his career yeah, does that make sense yeah. and that's okay yeah i don't think he thought of, of the rocky thing himself yeah i think all these ideas i i don't the last one lonely with the kid i don't think that was his idea either mm -hmm. i'm gonna be honest with you nah i'm just going same. by, by the same thing yeah <laughs> which is fine which is fine totally fine that's the way it works music videos are made to sell the song yeah right Exactly. Or, pay, or, pay, or paint a picture of who you are you know what i mean and resonate i know which is why sometimes like when i when i see some videos i'm kind of like what the fuck does this have to do with the song yeah like it's a completely it's like a weird video. like what it's a random story i'm trying to, I'm trying to remember yeah. i know what you're what, saying like what video but there is like it's like this whole some story that doesn't where, have anything to do with yeah the song. it's like what is it what what the hell did this have to do with the song i yeah. think that I, goes I, in, the, the video and the song just don't make sense together but to me that goes into intention. whatever works whatever like, works that goes into what 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 are you pushing what's your message and what are you looking to to get out of this you know what i mean mm -hmm. you know mm -hmm. that's a whole deeper conversation right that's a whole other um true. Anyway. that's why i think good music videos expand on what the song is already about that's yeah. a good music video yeah i think i like it man that's deep shit right there deep shit man that's what i'm known for deep shit bro <laughs> all right uh speak, <laughs> speaking of deep um justin ariana ariana dropped uh this is i mean she's dropped it but it's still i think it's good to talk about the ariana now it wasn't a documentary was it not guys? a documentary i didn't watch like, it did you watch it it wasn't a documentary i, I watched it, it twice. just a live concert that's why it kind of made me upset yes really yes yeah, I, I honestly like i was like dude she's post she's she's gonna put something on netflix i'm i'm ready to see what she like i want to know about her I behind the scenes really tell me about know. pete tell but me they didn't about really her. they didn't they didn't they didn't do anything what did they do they didn't was do it just anything. a i mean it, it was, was pretty concert much just a concert from london it was, it was just, just a concert, concert and then it kind of showed like little tiny like small footages like for example on her, her last backstage. day like you see her cry because she's Nikki. like expressing to her yeah, to her do you remember anything from behind the scenes huh do you remember anything behind the scenes because i don't know not really but i will say her performance, man, she is good. Then that's what I was going to say. Like what, yeah. the whole performance Ooh. thing. Like yes. I, from what I know, enjoy she gives like, watching her. Like I good. really like, yeah, 
that's why as much as I was like, damn, I wish it was more behind the scenes. Yeah. I enjoyed watching the show because she really knows how to entertain. Like entertain a crowd. And like how it got to how what it went into planning it, yes. the backstage mm-hmm. of it, her personally and like her involvement in it. All that stuff would be like, interesting. Honestly, to see, right? I think it's just I think it's amazing. And like just to see everything that goes into like. The planning a, perf- the, a performance and yeah. planning and like yeah. going on tour and everything it's exhausting yeah but it's like it's so exciting but that's also why she gets the bag i mean obviously you, you know the, that, yeah. that amount of hard work you know I mean, obviously that's Extra why she facts. deserves she deserves Extra what she facts. gets that's what i think but you're yeah. right man she uh she says sucks. it in the song i want it i got it she got it that sucks that they didn't really show a lot of behind the scenes nothing stuff. yeah you know it, it, was it a made really- me sad but i mean it's uh a really good it is what it one is. was the Beyonce one where they showed the behind the scenes yeah. of her oh uh, my Coachella God. performance. Home, homecoming? Yeah. Like that shit was dope because it showed everything leading up to it and it, all the planning, all and the And then practice. you get to see the show. Mm-hmm. And you get to see the That's show. That's how I was That's hoping. That's how I was hoping Ariana Grande's was going to be. Like yeah. you actually see like the rehearsals. You yeah. see, you can Them see her sometimes make in the studio thing. or something mm. or like things leading up to it. And then it's Yeah. Like, but I didn't do that. Anything. Was it if you think of it as like, oh, it's just like a recorded concert, it would be more yeah. enjoyable. If you didn't have the expectation of a documentary, yeah, yeah. you liked it better. Yeah. If be- they're like, it's a live concert recorded experience thing rather well, than. Well, but they can't do that because that would probably turn some people away. Right. right. I mean, like, Maybe. obviously, they, well, they want to be able- Sean Mendez was basically just a recorded no, concert. No, no, no. I saw the Sean Mendez one. No, no, no. Sean, they, they showed, they touched on. Him and she, uh, him and Camila, how they met. She she talked about it too, how they met and uh, going back home with his parents, and yeah. then you know see, it's them. Some personal shit. That's what people. Want it, to it was know. enough. It was enough. See. It wasn't like ooh, amazing. You know what I mean? I'm yeah. looking for that, but I mean, it showed enough. I mean, really, what do, what do you expect out of Sean Mendez? You know what I'm saying? If you want some, if you want some dirt, you need to watch the little peep one. Little peeps got one on um. On <laughs> I Netflix. haven't watched that it's good. one. It's good. Did you watch the Travis Scott? Yes, but I don't remember. I, <laughs> I, I, I don't remember the details. I don't remember. I like the Travis Scott. That one yeah, it was good. Pretty good. Speaking of Ariana, um, she announced recently her engagement. She's engaged. Yes, been dating this, yeah, she's been dating this real estate guy, Dalton Gomez, for like less than a year. I think it's been like 11 months, something like that. And um, rings. What's a large <laughs> ring? Is it eight carats? Is that a big ring? That's pretty big, right? I don't know what carrots are. Oh, no. <laughs> I don't, I don't understand. Sizes. I thought that was a size thing, but it's not a size The thing. average is one to 1.3. The average person's Carrot. engagement ring? Carrot, yeah. Engagement ring. I think my wife's is two. Really? Okay, baller. I think. Damn, big You don't even know? Shock. I don't remember. It was like three <laughs> Our three-year anniversary is this year. Oh. Aww. Crazy. You got to renew some vows or something. We're going right? to renew on our fifth. Oh, okay. We already have a plan. That's cool. Nice. <laughs> um, Wait, you guys been together and married for three years? Or? No, we married for three years this April, and then we've been together for, is it five? I think it's five. Yeah. Five total. Total. Okay. Dating. Yeah, two years dating. Married nice. three. So Ariana been dating this dude for a year, less than a year, 11 months. By the way, the ring Engaged. is- The ring, they said, is worth at least $750,000. So they, if, if media is saying at That's least- That's it? Well, no, hold on. They're saying at least. So you already know it's over a million dollars on that, on that and then the And then I believe the pearl came that was her from grandma's, her right? grandma. Her grandma. Well, no, grandpa. Grandma. Grandma. Really it was grandpa's grandma. pin. Did it come it from grandpa. her grandma or it was fashioned it after? From, it came from her grandma, but it was uh, from her, her I believe her grandpa's it. like pin or something. Oh, you sure? sure? Yeah. I just know I, she was really I, close I, to her grandma. I saw something like that. Because um, her grandpa's the one that passed away, right? I thought her grandma was her the grandma, one. Dude. Her grandma, dude. Her nana. She was really no, close to her nana's... grandma. Because there was, a, I remember she I posted a picture. I thought it was her grandpa. I'm nah. pretty sure it was her grandpa. Man, we're about to, I'll put money on it. How much are you going to put on it? 50 cents. 50 cents? Yeah, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> I'll bet you 50 cents right now that it was her grandma. I ain't got no cash on me though. <laughs> I'll Venmo you. You can Venmo me 50 cents. Yeah. <laughs> I'll Venmo you. <laughs> You're on. right. Shut I up. I told you. 50 cents. Venmo me right now. Should, damn, I should have. <laughs> I thought it was true. You are so <laughs> right, man. I should have got some bands, man. Bands. Hey, my motto for 2020 is I got bands in my future. I got future. bands. Tour late grandpa. Bands Good, man. You're future. right. Yeah, man. You're absolutely right, man. Good her shit, Her grandpa. Man. So so the 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 pearl came from her grandpa's like pin or something like that. Pin? What do you mean pin? I don't know. Some Something. That That's not had. really, guys. A lapel then, pin? Like, I, I think so. How about this? How about the fact that she kept the dating? She says she kept the dating um, on the DL, especially with her. And, because her and Pete Davidson's was like out there. Oh, By the way, let me okay. correct you guys. Oh, on the last there. episode, I was watching it back. The last episode, we were talking about Ariana Grande's exes. And I said she dated a dancer. Mm-hmm. 
Did but she, she not did. Did it She answer? did. That's what I meant. Like the the backup, like way back, way back. The backup. What's this a fly? <laughs> <laughs> you see that? It, what, what was that fuck? Uh, <laughs> in comes a fly. <laughs> The, <laughs> do you remember that um that 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 incident where she was licking the donut? Oh yeah, years ago. Yeah. She was dating one of her backup dancers. Oh yes, that's the reason. The, the we, one where every where everyone was giving her so much shit. Yes, she's being yeah. hella rude. That's yes. the reason we got COVID because she licked yes. that donut. Then it went <laughs> Mac. Donut. Then it went Damn Pete. It. Then it went so on and so uh, forth. So anyway, okay, I didn't know that. Um, Don Gomez is a real estate agent. I was doing my homework on him just to make sure. You know, I bet. So he's a he's a <laughs> high end real estate agent. Uh, I've been dating him less than a year. And it looks like he has his own money, but you know, she said they kept it under the radar and she thinks maybe that's why. Um, I read that he's very successful in the real estate. Yeah, but levels of success are that's the, the real day real estate. You know what I'm saying? Who knows? Yeah, oh right? my God. But you know what? Uh, What's for her, your, you what? can see that they, that doesn't matter. Yeah. That doesn't matter. I, uh, yeah. I don't think if it matters. If he got his own money, then it's fine. Now, here's my question though. Do you think, <laughs> I think all celebrities, if they were smart, which they're not, um, all celebrities, <laughs> if they kept their personal shit, like relationships <laughs> off social media, because you're celebrities, uh-huh. Everything looks at it with a fine tooth comb. Like with a, Iggy? Yes. Like Iggy Azalea. We got to talk about the Iggy Azalea. Well, but anyway, next. don't you think that would lead to better, more healthy relationships? Always. Not even just for celebrities, for regular, for people too. No, 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 no. But then we got to have entertainment. Like I looking, I like creeping. <laughs> on, come on, bro. I'm he talking. Said, well, we, I like creeping. We on like creeping on other shit. people's shit. Come on, man. But I'm saying for a healthy relationship, if you keep less on social, I mean, probably it, the better. Obviously, yeah. if you're like, especially if <laughs> you have a, fat ass fan base you uh-huh. know what i'm saying like yeah it's i think it would be best to stay low-key now in that situation do you think she should keep the entire like so going through the marriage just keep it all off social media just well no because it's out now yeah but she probably I mean, still, no probably, the I more- mean, but i feel like she she has learned her lesson yeah for pre- sure from previous relationships mm. so th- i feel like there's things that she will be able to put out and there's things that she'll keep it low keep it low do you guys feel mm-hmm. like you have a grasp of her personality no me neither. Yeah, that well, that's the whole point of the documentary. That's why I wanted to get to but know then who she I really was. I have no idea what she is like. Can I be honest with you? I don't either. As a person, this is well, and I, and I, that that's why I, I was very excited for the the documentary series because I was like, yes, I'm about to see this <laughs> shit. Nothing. I could be entirely wrong about Damn. I could be entirely wrong about all this. And uh-huh. if anyone's watching this, probably this is, I'm just paraphrasing. This is through a. <laughs> a a source who shall remain nameless. I'm sure she's very sweet. She comes off very genuine, but I heard seems to that be. she's a bitch. That's the word. No, That's hold, what on, I've hold, heard hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I've actually heard it. I'm not giving names either, but I have heard people that actually have gone into and the studio with, and like, and like didn't have a great experience. Life. Don't quote me on this, but I guess her parents come from money. Not that it matters because she's still talented, but I think her parents own a moving truck company. A That's the word. Truck. That's where the money's at. Yeah. Well, yeah. But I think company. they own, they own, I believe they own a moving truck company. So she's never had a problem with like struggling as far as getting lessons and getting mm-hmm. what she needs. But at the end of the day, it doesn't matter. She, I mean, talent's talent. Well, didn't but she start, she started off as acting. Didn't yeah, she, she was on started, Nickelodeon. Yeah. I watched that shit. Um, <laughs> um, Victorious. <laughs> Victorious, bro. Watch but, Vic- that was actually Victorious cool. Victorious probably shouldn't have been a kid show. You ever watch Victorious? I did. <laughs> Never saw it. There's a whole episode where they're all pra- where they're all in their like bikinis and sweating in a van. <laughs> well, it depends how you're looking Bro. at things, Justo. I mean, you're looking no, at it that I way. I swear to God, I mean, dude. There's some like weird shit that happened in that show. They were locked in the van. Yeah, and they're all sweating and wearing yeah, bikinis and I shit. I remember that. Do you know what I'm talking about? It's a whole thing. It's like a Pornhub video, no? It's like a Pornhub video. Yeah. 100%. You know, right? Uh, you know, no? 100%. No? Anybody? No? That's no. all I'm saying. I don't know. <laughs> hey. <laughs> <damn it>. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Okay, so... Okay, so okay, so, so keeping relationships on social media uh, is a good thing if you're famous. Got it. Now, how about this? How about after they're married for a long time and they're stable and they are bulletproof? You know, like you guys are, your relationship is bulletproof. You know each other. There's no, nothing can break you. Then is it cool just to keep, you know, just post it all up? It doesn't matter what the comments no. say. I no. mean, it depends still, on the I, relationship I too. If you look at someone like uh, John Legend and... um Chrissy Teigen, Chrissy, Chrissy Teigen, Teigen. Mm-hmm. like she, like there, she's on social nonstop. Bulletproof, bulletproof. Yeah, but that's what have, I'm talking but about. But it seems like they have a great relationship, and it doesn't really affect them. So it depends on the relationship too. Do they though? I mean, based purely on her Twitter, Do they though? that's it. That's no, all. I I and look at John, <laughs> but look at John Legend. He's a cool. He's calm, a really cool, calm, relaxed yeah. dude, right? Yeah. Dude, and she's kind I of think like it's so funny. They're just so different. I've yeah, seen. I saw great. a inter an interview. I think on the Ellen Show, and. She had her, you know, this is during the <laughs> pandemic too. She had her glass of wine. She's like, oh, yeah. you know, like, Hello, all bubbly. like yeah. yeah. And yeah. he's just like, huh? 
He's like, he's just hella smooth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. He's just John Legend. <laughs> yeah. He's like, yeah, man. I was like, man, they're so different, but it's just so funny. Sometimes it works. It's cool, though. Uh, it well, this didn't really work out. What about Iggy? Iggy Zalia? Playboy Cardi? Um, man, that, so that, what, so what I'm going to just roll my eyes to that, like. This is some crazy shit. So what happened? I'm a little behind. You want to paraphrase it? You want me to? I mean, we can both. So do so they okay. They, Playboy cart Playboy, Playboy Cardi cheated. Is a dumbass cheater, <laughs> and like Iggy a lot? is a dumbass for staying with him throughout the She's whole. She's a process. dumbass for dating him. Right. His his name is Playboy. I mean, okay. <laughs> no, seriously, <laughs> stupid. And also, Vicky, who is the past? Who did she date before? Damn it, she's dated rappers and and, and basketball like basketball players, players a lot. Um, she dated a yeah the, the basket that that's the one that I knew about. I'm so bad with names, dude. Yeah, whoever I forget. Now. Nick Young, yeah, French Montana, boom, 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 Tiger. Oh anyway. shit, she dated French Montana. Word. She probably banged him, dude. They called it dating. She probably look banged at him. the end of the day, <laughs> like certain stereotypes. I mean, I'm not saying it's for everyone, but. I don't think she should be in the rap game when it comes because she's looking. She, <laughs> Julian, you can't judge somebody by the name of their like, of their rap name, right? No, like no, you, no, 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 no. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm saying she wants to get wiped up. She wants a stable relationship. Oh, she yeah. wants a family. A am I right? Yeah. From that, you could tell by the. I believe that voicemail. It didn't make me sad, but I also low key laughed too because she <laughs> wants stability. She's asking. She's asking stability. She, she's asking for family. Uh huh. From the wrong people in the wrong industry. She needs to date and marry someone at Starbucks. But <laughs> seriously, a normal person, like a real estate agent. But then, like, go ahead. like a real estate agent. agent. Like a real estate agent. But You're not again, wrong. Like, but then again, you also have to remember that there are some artists that have two different lives. Far like, and few between. About it, Far and few between. You know what I'm saying? I you're right. And, <laughs> but, but there's your persona and what, then there's who you are. Exactly. I'm not and saying, if you are you could give off the impression that you're just like um like the rapper who bangs all these you chicks. You never know I somebody until you know somebody. No, I, yeah. I agree with you. But at the end of the day, if you're if we're just gonna gamble, if we're just gonna make a blanket stereotype, like a the blanket for example, like when I say most Asian drivers, most dri Asian drivers cannot drive. I'm telling you, most Asian drivers can't drive. Is that everyone? No. I, dude, I'm telling you, my no, ass drives 40 and a 60. I but understand. you get what I'm saying? No, I do. I'm not do. saying this for each and everyone, but it's true. Like, okay, when you have when you have a bunch of vagina, or let's say it's a mercy, <laughs> or, no, I'm serious, or a guy, or girl has so a bunch much, of dick, right? So much vagina. No, coming at you, coming at you. No, just no, 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 no. All no, sides. I know, I know. I'm, 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 it's, it's all just, sides, it's just dicks everywhere. <laughs> Or vagina. Everywhere. Behind you, <laughs> under you, everywhere. Whatever you want. Uh, whatever you want. But whatever is your thing. What I'm saying is- Whatever it is, it's everywhere. It's so You have so many choices. Like, for example, Playboy Cardi. Mm -hmm. Bro, he's 20. He's younger than her. You're going to tell me it's very hard to say no. That's all I'm trying to say. You got to- let's, let's be- You let's can say be, that about a lot of just dudes in their 20s. When you're let a celebrity- Let you, alone musicians. Yes, but can you imagine being a musician, having the world at the world at your fingertips, having all that power? I mean, at the, same, at the end of the day, is that like you can't change somebody that doesn't want to be changed. If, yeah. That doesn't want to change. If you're you with someone I mean? who, like, there's people who are in the public spotlight and who don't just cheat on all the time. You but, know there's vaginas I'm not everywhere. Saying everyone. But at you the get same what I'm time, saying? I'm not saying, hey, look, I know, it's a case but by like, case. I'm but, saying, like, you, if you have a type, and that type is toxic for you, then you're going to run into problems. Look, at that's the, what I'm saying. She has a type. This is the wrong type. <laughs> at the end of the day, Sorry. the saying goes, <laughs> fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, shame on me. Yes. Has Iggy, he been caught cheating before? You're fucking idiot. Huh? Has he been He's caught cheating before? fucking 24. Dude, he, he, was, he was cheating. He continues to cheat. Uh -huh. uh, even like he's he's always like oh you know I, she's just like before this just though side hoe, he's like this and that damn and he's young how old is Iggy Azalea <laughs> isn't she like in her she's 30s she's in her 30s right that's young keep dude. talking um, <laughs> no like I mean she's 30 she's 30 she's yes 30. so her maturity 24. level is so much higher yeah. sorry yeah no it's Very just excited. at the end of the day it's just yeah, fuck you know what like, I forgot to like, do honestly like hold on Iggy you're savage for the shit that you did but you're also very stupid for like <laughs> hanging on like I understand like I get it I understand because y'all got a kid you want him you want the, the best for your for your kid of course she, she's and trying that, to make it and work and that's perfectly she understandable I have two kids like I know like I understand but at the same time like Girl, have some respect for yourself. And like if the dude isn't willing to meet you halfway, then it's not exactly it's like right. at the like you know at the end of the day he's gonna keep fucking telling you shit. And the fact that yeah he keeps telling you this, you're like fine, whatever. I want to do this because we got a kid together. But then you're over here fucking having your homegirl go like show up to the house to 
catch the bitch there. <laughs> like, even after all this shit. She's like, playing in them dumb you know games. What I'm yeah. It's kind of like, yeah. there's how much are you going to take until somebody, until you're, you're done? Like, bitch, you're saying you're done, but obviously you're not. Obviously no. you like this. Well, and it's, uh, like, there, there's so the many different that gets layers. Because at the end of the day, girls are petty as fuck. <laughs> yeah. Girls are conniving. I'm sorry. There's, like, okay, not all. Sorry. Not all. Let me, let me take that back. Not a bunch. All. Not all. But a handful. There are a lot of girls that really don't give a fuck. Like, the, they don't. They don't care. And because uh -huh. of that, it's like, there's a lot of layers to this. Man, I'm, and Iggy, we, girl. Would you say, would you agree with this statement? I'll help you. Would you agree with this statement? Dumb girls and dumb guys deserve to get cheated on. Would you agree? Would you I don't think anyone deserves to be cheated on. But I think No, no, no. Fool me what? Would you say fool me once, fool me twice? Fool me if, fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, shame on just me. Just so if you keep going back. When I say, look, yeah, I, keep going don't, back. don't take me literally. What I'm saying is like, if oh, you're I'm gonna dumb, take you literally. but if you keep going back, <laughs> then you're dumb. So what I say, what, I'll say it again. Dumb girls I think and dumb, dumb guys deserve to get cheated on. You keep going back, that's your fault. Dumb is a strong word. But some you people, need to be strong. I would, say, I would say dumb choices. Dumb choices is a better way to look at it. And you're, being, some people, you're being too nice. Some they, people they need to hear are, this. Some people are addicted to these kind of relationships. Then that's their fault. Sad. That's their damn oh. fault. That's that's That takes some time and like therapy to like get over because there are people who get into toxic relationship after toxic relationship mm -hmm. because Iggy? that's all they know they she probably had parents mm -hmm. who had a shitty relationship and that's no. all she sees no, and no, that's no, all no. she knows how I, to do. I, I think she wants to be a part of the fame she that's why i think she just is attracted to basketball players and rappers and i think she just likes black guys to be honest with you and that that's what it is but we didn't even give the whole backstory so just so real quick <laughs> basically oh my god we went on this whole so for people that know I the know. story for, for people that don't basically and stop me where I'm wrong. I'm gonna make it really quick. Yeah, sum it up. She had a baby recently, like what? Just uh, during the holidays, right? Yeah, no, I think November. So, anyway, I don't know. Recently. She recently had a baby with Playboy Cardi, and she found out. She found out. She's been finding out like for the longest time that he's been cheating on her with this girl named Side Chick is Brandy. I think since like February. That's so a like side March. chick name too. Brandy. No, her name is Brandy. Brandy. Oh yeah, yeah I know. Right. That's a side chick name, Brandy. I looked her up. Oh, <laughs> Come on. Oh, God. Come on. She actually has a channel on YouTube. We'll talk about that later. <laughs> anyway, she's. And yes, Julian looked her up. She of is course. very, very. She's hot. I, I, I can see why he. She looks like a brandy. <laughs> I can see why he cheated. I ain't going to lie. Um, But so essentially she uh, he started getting all this information and started finding stuff around the house, blah, blah, blah. And, you know, like most guys, he's. Go ahead. Yeah, no, sorry. Uh -huh. No, he gave her the run around oh yeah she's nobody 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 mm. um i'm trying to like hurry this up because there's so many layers to this you want to add in yeah Anything? i mean he locked he locked all her shit like all of iggy's shit into the nursery room because what? um you know they he, like, i guess because they were saying that they were already gonna move to atlanta and they were gonna get rid of the apartment in la so they had models here they had like just hella he just gave shit. a lot of excuses Yo, during this whole time like yeah. Now this is what's hurtful. I, like I feel bad, but at the same time I don't feel bad. Like right. it's kind of dumb on Iggy, but it's also hurtful because I feel bad for her when she had her child. Did you know that? According to her, she said that he didn't show up. Oof, that's rough for the baby. And Christmas, he said, "quote unquote," or she said that they were supposed to they were supposed to spend Christmas together. He took a, a jet to Atlanta to to hang out with his boy. Um, I forgot who, but anyway. And they were gonna come back. Something. He was going to see them Christmas he Day. He left them. No, he flew out Christmas Day. He was in LA Christmas Day. Dude, can you imagine? So just so he flies out to Atlanta, yeah. leaves him, leaves his kid uh -huh. and Iggy, his girl, his girl in LA alone. Yeah. Christmas. Yeah. Just it's, all these different instances. And she's shitty. Yeah. And yeah. the whole time on Brandy's story, oh my gosh, you know, I love you. I'm hanging out with my guy. You know, and you're seeing all this, you're, you're seeing all, all uh, on social media how the side chick is basically, she ain't even hiding like it. She's posting, like she's posting pictures with on, him of and the shit. elevator yep. and like yeah. this, and she's like, what the fuck? Like, yeah. And and from what you were saying, it's like she, uh, when she hit her up, when she hit Brandy up saying, what's up? You're fucking with my mans is yeah. not like she blocked them. Uh -huh. I mean, she blocked her. Uh -huh. And then, like, I guess she blocked her off social media, too. Oh, and then man. she unblocked her. Off, uh, uh, she unblocked Iggy off social media. And then mm. I guess because I guess Iggy uh, went in to see and she was unblocked. And then she saw uh -huh. a picture, a new picture uh -huh. of like her posting like on the elevator or some shit. I don't know. But I was just like, Ooh. damn, like I'm like the th and that's why and that's why I say, like, as much as I feel bad at the same time, I don't. Yeah. Yeah. Because it's like. 
fuck like like i like i just continue to say like how much how much are you gonna take like yeah. obviously you still you say you're done you say you're over it this is not no. but yet you continue to fucking go like go through this like i so think obviously there's a part of you that as much as you don't like it you kind of do like i think it. when you're a celebrity if, if, if it is then shit i think when you're a celebrity it's hard to <laughs> it's hard to uh-huh. want it's hard to date a normal you know a guy that's not in that space so i think there's that and also i just want to add in i don't know if you saw this and um but he she iggy on her video she's going in saying you know she's using side chick like it's a bad it's a bad thing but here's I mean, my thing. Hold, hold on, hold on. It, it, it should be. It, it should be, right? Yeah. But she's saying, you're just a side chick. He's banging five other, five or six other girls that you don't even know about, right? And according to Iggy, he actually didn't even start hooking up with Brandy. He hooked up with her, her girlfriend first. They started hanging out in the studio. But she so, knew all this? Yeah, she's finding all this information out and oh, she's she's talking about it in her, this IG, this IG live oh. thing is like 40 minutes long. <laughs> no, it's like so, 30. 31 minutes. 30, okay. I believe. Sorry. So <laughs> I looked, I said, fuck, this is long. So if, Damn. but when you start going in, I was like, oh, shit. <laughs> so if Playboy, so let's just, let's just go with that. Playboy is started hooking up with Brandy, the side chick. So Brand, Brand, Brandy's friends started getting, you know, banged. And then, <laughs> and then, and then, sorry, I'm just, no, I just, sorry. and then Playboy <laughs> says, I'm done with you and starts hooking up with Brandy. What, essentially what I'm trying to say is like, I don't think they care. Meaning when you're, when Iggy's trying to the insult girls? them, you, the specific girls, these girls, the side chicks. Yes. Do you think they really care? I think they're okay with it, bro. Yeah. Like, Obviously. Yeah, but yeah. Iggy's trying to hurt them. <laughs> Iggy's trying to hurt them. Like, you're just a side chick. Like, think about where they're coming from. If they got no viewers, At right? You're the getting day, their clout up, man. Iggy, yeah. I think you like being in an open relationship. Ooh, hot take. I'm hot take. That. Hot take. One more thing. Just kidding. <laughs> one more thing. Oh, no. One more thing. Now you would this know. Is my opinion. You would I'm know. I'm gonna cut that out. I'm gonna you, cut out the part where you said I'm kidding. What do you no. think about the theory? <laughs> so Vicky, his new album dropped same time. This whole controversy. Oh dropped. shit! Hold on. So what do you think? Do you think so? Iggy, it's all fake. This whole thing. If now I was here, he'd say. Well, no, Iggy waited to drop all this all this tea because she wants to ruin his album sales. Uh, what do you think? Or increase his album sales. If Ooh. Nia was here, he'd say that this was all a strategy. It's all fabricated. It's all fabricated. I don't it think then, done this would have to be some really damn good oh, acting. That's what I was going to say too. That's what I was going to say too because no way. she was saying that when she was pregnant, she wanted, when she started to show, she wanted to like She wanted to tell it, everyone. She yeah. wanted to tell it, but then he kept saying no. Don't he said, do no, don't do it because I'm about to drop my album. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. So Why would her being pregnant mess up with his album? I don't Two different messages, you know what I mean? Know. That doesn't make sense. Know. That's stupid. Well, I mean, I think he wants all the when he wants when, to look single. No, nah, well, I mean, I would think he wants, all, you know, there's so many messages going on these days. He wants it <laughs> all to be focused around his new album release because he hasn't dropped new music so long, right? So you, you bring, but you bring in the kid, you know what I mean? Then it becomes yeah, that would bring more attention to you because like, oh, I, I don't know, a kid, that's so nice. People love babies. Do you think Iggy specifically <laughs> waited? I mean, she obviously want, she wanted to do something. She wanted to, you know, have her voice heard. So she waited for his well, album to drop. She did say, she did say um, that she told them she's just going to file, uh, like, file for custody. Huh? Shit. She's going to go to court. Hey, the if there's evidence year. of him cheating, she'll And then he was it. like, well, really? Okay. Cool. <laughs> like, the way she fucking, like, mimicked him was just hilarious. She is she funny. Like, okay, she is funny. Cool. Like, I was, funny. I was cracking up. She Yo. had me fucking weak. I'll be honest. I low key like her more after that. Like, do I like the way she says "cool"? Did you ever hear like she's responding "cool, cool"? Her accent, like, yeah. Where's she from? Australia. Australia. Oh, Australia. Word. Yeah. (laughs) I like her accent. I I was really fucking with her accent. I was like, like, that's so funny. It was funny. It was it was it was comedy. But um, oh, and then she did say she did draw. uh, There's a there's a, a video on her Twitter about her about her homegirl. Going into the house at three in the morning, kicking her out, kicking her out. Wait, kicking out of watching. Iggy's house, kicking, kicking her yeah. out, out of the um, they rented, right? They rented yes. him at Playboy. Yeah, but here's the thing, and I, then the maid, and then the fucking maid, when she showed a picture of Brandy, she was like, Yeah, that was a girl that's hiding in the closet. Okay, yes, Ooh, but I was like, Bitch. Brandy, did you see Brandy posted on her IG, the side chick? She said, I didn't get kicked out. I was actually just leaving. She said this. She she said that on her IG story. Oh, I didn't see. That. I didn't so know she's that story. one person saying one thing, other person saying another thing. Uh-huh. She said that. Well, where's the video? I want to see the video. I didn't get a chance to go. On there's a video, the video, but there's no audio. Ah, uh, it, it doesn't look like she's getting kicked out. Looks like yeah. And then she was like, and then she was saying, uh, she can post a full video if she wants. Yes. And I said, then post it, bitch. 
Everybody wants to know. Bitch. Everybody wants to know. I think it'll probably will be out by the time this drops. It probably so? yeah. Do you think this is done, or you think this Iggy saga is going to continue? Fuck for your mental health. I hope it's over. Well, I like. I really do. But how about this? If you're but, if you're Playboy Cardi, what would you do? Would you just be quiet? I oh, don't know. You see, what I'm saying. I mean, I don't know. I would. Uh, I've never looked at it from his perspective. I mean, you're, he's a dumbass though. I yeah, mean, he's 24, sure. dude. He wants to, he wants to, obviously he wants to continue to be with her, but at the same time, like he wants to be in an open relationship. That, that's how I see it. It's like, I'm going I'm to fuck with you, but I want to fuck with these other bitches too. <laughs> it goes back you to know? choices. I'm going to fuck with these other bitches too. It goes so back to choices. You no, know, but I don't know. I mean, he's young. I mean, I, shit. Yeah, I mean, did he mean to knock her up? Probably like, not. You know what I'm saying? Like, 24, man. I was fucking dumb. And that's why all you people out there use protection be Always safe if you don't want to get doesn't caught up good, in a though, situation man. it doesn't feel as good how are you but not vicky when you tell a guy that i mean some guy but i mean it doesn't it doesn't feel and it doesn't feel as good for the girl too that's i, I mean okay well then if you excuse. well then guess what if you no, but, if, if, if you know, don't want to okay well then listen listen now, if, a if a dude you don't want to use you. if you don't want to use protection ladies Plan. That's what Plan B is for. Plan B. Get you know what I'm saying. Or Plan there's C. There's like there's there's different ways of there's going. No plan C? I don't know or what or, or something called the pull out game. You know, ah, just pull out. I love pull out yeah. game strong. You just y'all let, stupid. You, you know what I'm saying. <laughs> but I mean, there's different ways. There's to, there's not to be responsible. There's so many strategies. Yeah. That. I mean, I'm just it's for your sake. Don't put yourself. Don't just don't put yourself in that position. That, yeah. Don't put yourself in that position. 100%. If you don't want to have a kid. If you don't want to end up with this person, there's different ways <laughs> of going about it. Okay. All right. And I'm looking directly at y'all. I love it. Just saying. Last but not least, I'm going to throw you guys a curveball. I'm going to throw you guys a curveball. Okay. okay? Shit. I can't help curveballs. Is, is this what you told us that you wanted to get our like actual initial reaction? No, that was a personal story, oh, but okay. I'm going to save it. My All friend's right. getting married. Ah, see, I did a teaser. Oh, My teaser. friend's getting married and I'm a little see nervous about it. Uh, congratulations. Congratulations. Well, I'm not getting married. I'm uh, oh, my friend. Your friend. Congratulations. Oh, okay. cool. Duh. Friend. Uh, we'll save that for next episode. So, okay, you have to answer this, okay? If oh, you had a choice shit. to open the country back up yes. or keep it shut down, which which way are you going to go? And no, no in-between answers. Are you going to open the country back up or keep it shut down? Shut down. You Are you just saying that because you don't want to... No, get I people mean pissed it. off? No, I mean it. You should, we should be shut down more. So why? Because COVID cases are just as bad as they've ever been. And we By the way, are you saying, are you, like, that's what I was going to ask too. Do you mean like <laughs> open or shut down with COVID still happening? Like right now, uh -oh. like right now, 2021, would the way be more shut down. <laughs> okay. But, but, but ju just though, from your perspective, but what about the perspective of the uh, business owner, the local business owner that basically yeah. is on their last legs of being on the street? Ideally, and all the homeless that are even more homeless and people that right. are about to go homeless. Well, ideally, if the government wasn't full of fucking monsters, we would have already, we would have had a better stimulus package for small businesses to be able to stay afloat. We'll talk about the stimulus right. shut down. Yeah. But the stimulus package is fucking barely anything. By the way, did you guys get your stimmy? No. no? Did you? I got mine. Wait, hold on. Did you get it in your bank account? <laughs> yeah, I went to my bank account. Should I be nervous? Yeah. I didn't get my 600 yet. Wait, did you? It goes did however. Did you get your previous one? Yeah. Yes. Well, then it how did be you there. get it? Check some people haven't gotten it yet. Bank account. And then it should. Yeah. So I haven't gotten it yet. Some people haven't gotten it. I haven't gotten mine. They do waves. My dude got it. They do waves. Yeah. Both my me and my wife got ours. Yeah. My dude got it. I haven't gotten mine. Okay. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> By the way, it went from it was supposed to be two thousand fucking six hundred dollars. That's a bunch of bullshit, don't you think? It's a whole thing. <laughs> well, how much did you get? Did you 600? get six hundred? Six hundred. If you have kids, you get more. Yeah, six hundred each. But still, man. Yeah. I mean, Mitch McConnell. Anyway, He's a monster. Whatever. Whatever. Yeah. That's what um, I'm saying. That's why we're well, back to your question. What's the answer? Shut down. But obviously. From your perspective. But what about yeah. the perspective? I mean, are you taking into account all the people that are about to go homeless? <laughs> you make me sound like a monster. <laughs> okay. You're a monster. Know, all the people that are struggling. I, the only reason I would want us to be locked down is, is if everyone got the money that the government should be giving us to stay afloat so we can be shut down without so you running think, out of business. So you think $600 is the game changer for these No, people. it's not nearly enough for anything. <laughs> right. But in an ideal world, it would be way more money regularly for everybody. And then we could stay shut down and actually, you know, not give everybody COVID. Wait, COVID cases have gone even higher? Yeah. Yeah, it's the highest it's ever been. California. Especially is the worst. California. Uh, is it because of the new the, the new type of COVID? 
Oh, I've heard about. Uh, I not. I don't know about. You that haven't one. heard. Did you hear I about heard that? about it, but I know. I don't think that's the reason why we have it. Uh-huh. Everyone just has regular COVID. <laughs> Vicky, what do you think? Which way? Fuck COVID. If you had to choose one. Um. <laughs> ideally, because <laughs> ideally you want you, it you, to be you, open. You don't want to look insensitive. I, mean, I, I would. Uh, uh, ideally, you want it to be open, but like it's yeah. dangerous. Yeah, but I mean, people I, are running around with no masks. Coughing, cough, coughing. Yeah, each other's people pages. are fucking stupid, man. I hate that shit. Like, but where you, I don't care if <laughs> you don't. I mean. Even if you don't like, like Lil Pump. Even if you don't believe. Oh God, I hate that guy. <laughs> Yo, like, put a fucking mask on. Did it's you plan on talk, talking about him? No, but because oh, you mentioned kid. it, because yeah. you mentioned oh, the masks. Yeah, because you the mentioned the thing. mask. Because like people can't handle putting a mask on their face, even at Costco. It's annoying, have dude. A my flight home, my flight home from Austin. What happened? We were on our way. Like we were on it. We had filmed uh, my music video. So mm-hmm. we were like, cool, let's head, let's head back home. We were on our flight. Um, so we flew from Austin to Vegas. Um, and then we were going from Vegas home. And we had everybody was seated. The, you know, one of the flight attendants was actually kind of rude. But, <laughs> you know, that's whatever. Um, and she kept telling everybody, make sure you put your mask on. There's some people that would put their mask, but they wouldn't put it over their nose. Yeah, she yeah. goes, it has to be over your nose. So we're like, fuck, fine. So they did it. Um, the airplane started uh, pulling back to go onto the fucking one way, one way, right? Mm-hmm. But it stopped, and it stopped because the flight attendant said, "Hey guys, we're actually gonna go back <laughs> to the." Uh, Wait, Lil Pump was on your flight? No, Lil Pump was not on oh, my flight. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> but we had to Sorry. go back <laughs> to the to the gate uh-huh. because. Somebody didn't want to wear their mask. Dude, it's not So that I was like, are you fucking kidding me? Dude, we wanted to get home. Like what, what, everybody just wanted like, to yeah. get fucking Wait, Was there home. a big scene or you, Yeah, it you was just a, it was a big ass commotion because like there were cuz you know the flight attendant um said it on the comm they were like, "Oh, you know, uh we're actually going to go back to the gate because, you know, not everyone is putting on their mask and mm-hmm. you know it's for safety reasons isn't that." And then you just hear everybody's like, "Oh, are you kidding me?" Yeah. Like it was just bad. And yeah. then there were some other people that were on the flight too that started like going back and forth with the flight attendant really? and they were yeah because it, they were just like i mean are you can tell the they were people? they were younger kids they're like uh-huh. younger I hate are they the, the people, same people who weren't wearing the mask or someone else no they more. were wearing masks but they just uh, started kind of going they're back just and mad forth. they got to be put through this situation yeah and You're then mad at the guy not wearing a mask but, no we were because yeah. then the person gets out yeah and then um, <laughs> this person would rather not fly than dude, put a mask on. I don't. I don't. Know. People just care about themselves, know. man. Crazy. People are not the problem it with was, this. It was horrible. It was nighttime. Like I was just like, dude. We just everybody just wanted to get home. Yeah. Like there were people like out with their phones, like trying to record and stuff. But it was yeah. just kind of like, dude, why is it so hard? I understand that you guys don't like it. Yeah. You know, but. I mean, don't be insensitive. Like, yeah, dude, it's not fuck. that big of a thing. Like, it's horrible. Right, like, it's no. It's so horrible. It's like, look at doctors. Do doctors fucking wear that shit all the time. All Do you fucking see them complaining? 15 and hours And from what shifts. I've actually heard is that there have been more suicides than there have been deaths from COVID. Yep. And a bunch of them have been doctors and nurses. That's what I've heard. Work. Really? Yeah. Yeah, that's what I've heard. I've heard that a lot of suicides have been from nurses that, because they're tired. Like, hella shit's going... So it's kind of like... I think fuck, people like, are you like guys, man. People situations. I mean, fuck. Like that. I may be wrong. I may be wrong on that, but that's just you know what I've read. That's what I've heard, and it's it's sad, and it's, it's kind of like true. fuck, it's still dude. True. Like even if you don't like want to take care of yourself, like unfortunately, there's, then, then stay home. How about that? Yeah, yeah. exactly. Un- unfortunately, like, there's a portion of the people in the country that don't think like that. They're always they're just thinking about in the moment, me, me, me. How does it affect me? But then they, they don't think about the fact that it delays the whole flight. And you're right. Yeah. I wish people just were more like empathetic and understanding that you know it's not a big deal just put on the mask and get through it it's like a couple hours of your life yeah you know but unfortunately that's why yeah the f- di- different people live dude the here flight and- was about 45 minutes like 45 yeah. minutes to an hour so dude. and it's like dude you can't just keep that on for that so like, ev- eventually let's just fast forward so eventually keep on the mask and you guys yeah but it delayed our flight yeah. like an extra 45 minutes that- to just to be on just to wait in the gate for uh-huh. us to finally be able to take off that that person should a so that person Damn, flew shit. he just ended up putting no, i don't think on, so or they got kicked out uh, they got kicked out oh they did yeah because i was gonna say that person Good. a should be fined b kicked out or c have their ass kicked yeah but we had to but then <laughs> we had to wait because now um they had to file paperwork yeah i do whole thing for huh? it and also that's what that's what really delayed it because i believe the flight attendant had to leave 
to do the paperwork. So now we have to wait for a new flight attendant to come in. And it was just, oh my God. It's like a whole thing. So what's your answer? Are you going to open the country back up or are you going to shut it down? Oh shit. We hella went in different directions. No, no, no. Right? It's cool. Um, I Final answer. I mean, I kind of like the way things have been, where things have been open. Uh-huh. But partially, it's not open though. It's it's pretty. Well, things kind of started. I mean, if you if you go if you went down to like San Francisco and if you gone to the mission, like there was this whole area where they actually had open seating. They actually blocked off a certain parts of Valencia. Um, But as a whole, as a whole, would you want the whole country shut down? Is is that what you're saying? You just want to keep it as is. I would keep it as is. Really? Because I want to. I mean, I want to. People are always going to continue to support. How about this? Business. Uh, that's that's what I. That's my biggest thing. Yeah, I, yeah I but it's not enough support. business though. Like the takeout business, it's not. So how about this? How about this? How about opening the country back up with restrictions? Is that kind of? Am I giving kind of a luke, lukewarm like answer there? A little bit. Like we restrictions, have restrictions. Like restrictions. Already. Like what though? Because um, yeah, and that's true, we, we have do. a restriction where you're supposed to wear masks, but people don't even want to do that. See, I don't know where you're at. I everywhere I'm at is people are pretty responsible. I haven't seen people most, running around with no masks like you. For the say. most part, yeah, you're right. Like for the most part, there are people who are. Most, How about this? Especially here. How about this? People are pretty much used opening to opening the country back up, but not to the level of where the clubs are packed and the bars are open and there's 300 people packed in a room. How about that? There's got to be some sort of normalcy. I don't want to look like an entire dick. Well, I think I don't they look already. Like I, think they, I think they they had already started doing that. No. Yeah, but in, the, in, in some places, like ta- but I'm talking about in ge- like blanket statement, like for the entire country. Because like here, everything, all bars, all clubs are shut down. Uh-huh. For for example, but you said Texas, it's open, right? Yeah. So I guess what I'm saying is, I hate to say it, man. I mean, open the country back up, but maybe in stages. I I don't fully agree with like 100, percent but we tried that though, and then we all got COVID again. <sighs> See, I guess I got to be there, man. There's I got to no, I, I gotta no be winning. in the hospitals. I got to see these cases and see how bad it really is. I guess that's really what it is, man, because I don't. I'll so you, you think that. you think what they're saying could be a lie? I'm not saying it's a lie, but I'm one of those people. I need to see it. I'm not saying it's a lie. To understand to how bad it, it is. Yes. Yeah. And also how old the people are. If it's if it truly is people that are over 60, 55 and they have pre-existing conditions. Well, that's what I mean. Then you open the country back up with restrictions, something to protect them. Is that fair? How about that? Is that fair? No. <laughs> no. Again, I don't so, know about this, man. It, the no, whole thing is like I don't think so because then, like, if, if 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 most a majority of the people have it have pre existing conditions and they're over the age of 55, 60. sixty. I'm just saying, uh-huh. what if, right? Let's just say, uh-huh. let's just say that's true. Then, well, then can we can we can we can we grow, can we open up the country in stages, but take that into consideration to protect them? Yeah, but like, what, what would, what, how would we protect them? Like, what would? Well, we I don't do know. I mean, that's not my them? job. That's the I mean, only take thing. all the old I feel people like... and put them in a room together and just leave them there. Stop. Because <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I feel like at the same time, like as much as we want to do that, that's not going to be fair. Because if then, because then if you do restrict them from stuff, like it, it's going to make them feel like fuck. Well, no, I... but maybe they could come on certain hours. I, you guys, all nah. I'm saying is, okay, how about this? This ain't gonna sustain. Fuck you, it, shut down. Well, that's okay. my answer okay. now. There shut down. Okay, so shut it down. Cool. It's been decided. That's cool. it. It's been cool. decided. You, shut right. this down. This is the way. Everyone's in agreement with you guys. That it, way it's fair for everybody. If, if yeah. we did an experiment, everybody say the fuck home. Sure. And if the experiment and this experiment, okay, fine. Do an experiment. If the entire country shut down for another year, watch what happens to the country. That's all I'm gonna say. You will. You will see riots. You will see revolts like no other. Yeah, the, the, I, I say it like that. I know. <laughs> what? Yeah. what? Said it's so intense. Well, I, yeah. I, I'm saying you're gonna see people because in a real life situation, it's been people, lockdown. Yeah, we dude, already did this a year ago, dude. Where I did it a year. Yo, ago. honestly, but though, you're going like, from this level compare, to this level. Compared people to act- from what it was first, first to yeah, like where it is now. Was I was low. Down. I was low key scared too in the beginning. In the beginning, yeah, that shit was scary as fuck. That shit fuck. was locked down at first. Like I still remember. I now still it's practically those normal. Days. I can go to the store. I still remember how it felt. Yeah, it was crazy at first. Right now, it's practically normal. I can go to Walmart right now, get a TV, and go out to eat. I can do whatever the you fuck cannot I want go right out now. to eat. What do you mean go out to eat? I can go get food. I mean, yeah, but what I'm saying is that business. Think about that. That person is lo- losing 80 percent of the business. That's why if do you, you eat out, do, make sure do, you do, tip. Tip. Man. But you, what do you mean? There's no eating out. If you go get food, I eat out all the time. There was outdoors. There's outdoor seating. Not everywhere. Majority not. Take that shit home. Eat in the car. It's not that hard. But eat at the I, park. No, 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 no. I love eating the car. Justo, eat, I get eat, it. Eat at the park. <laughs> Justo, do you think what you're saying is is right? But do you think most people are tipping their takeout? They're not. That's they why you should. Th- I tip hard. The most amount. Okay, people are. That's pe- where people suck. The people that dine in <laughs> restaurants, it doesn't convert to takeout. A lot of them are just hunkering down at home and eating more at home, which yeah. is good for them, but it's bad for the actual businesses. 
This goes back to what I said about the government. And that goes into retail. That goes into clothing. That goes into all of it. Amazon's doing great. Yeah. Online's doing great. E-commerce doing great. But the actual fucking store- Amazon. <laughs> yeah, I know. this whole different conversation. But you kind of get what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah that, that that that's what I'm saying. Don't be surprised if you see if you're you're this this whole thing of keeping it shut down for another year. If that happens, don't be don't be surprised. Well, I'm glad I'm su- not mayor then. That's all I'm saying. Okay. I don't want to make that decision. <laughs> all right. Well, I'm so happy I'm not in politics. <laughs> like, ah, oh, shit. Anyway, by the way, dude, can I just say if oh, man, dude. I would love to fight Lil Pump. I, I, I no, he did guy. not. I, I hate you, that guy. You could take him. Lil Pump. You could take I, him. I think I could take him. Lil Pump. Him. Gucci gang, Gucci can, gang, Gucci can gang. Can we leave it at this? <laughs> Vicky Justo, why, is, why has no one in the rap game kicked his ass? With the amount of like. Because COVID, you don't want to catch COVID from him because he doesn't wear a mask. He, he probably you know, has COVID. He's going to cough on you. You don't want to punch a guy. He probably who has COVID. Wear a mask. Yeah. <laughs> he is the worst. Is he not the worst human being ever? I'm sorry to bring that up. I just can't get him. I just hate this kid. I really hate him. I know. Just the, the rudeness, just the, the amount of like. Um, it's all a publicity stunt. You think so? Big balls, man, to make the videos that he does. <laughs> Big balls to act the way he does. Yeah. Yeah. I think I, he's an attention seeker. I can't wait to see him in 20 years. I'm going to laugh my ass off. I'm still waiting for him to fucking leave the country because of uh, what you call it. Trump. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Fun. Where's your flight, bro? You said you was trying to leave. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Cool. All right. Uh, let's end it, man. Uh, Lesson to your podcast, episode 38 next week. Yes, and, hopefully uh, now will be back with yes. us. He will. he will. And he'll tell me everything that he hates about Soul and I'll tell him everything <laughs> I love about Soul. You think he you think he's not gonna like it? Yeah, out of my Facebook. Uh, it was too emotional. Like, I hated it. Oh, he said it? He yeah. wrote that he put on Facebook. <laughs> Wait, he we'll said talk. he hated Soul? Wait, he's on Facebook? Yeah, he's on Facebook. Everyone's on Facebook. You, ha- you almost don't have a Well, no, I him. know he's on Facebook, <laughs> but I didn't know he wrote it on Facebook. He uh he put out an article saying it's um it doesn't I forget I can't Talk well, about well, as well as he can. We'll He'll let him. Okay, I have to see this. Niall, what? Right. Is, what? <laughs> make, make sure to like, subscribe, share if you rock with it. And uh, we appreciate you supporting and we'll catch you next week. Yes, yeah, stay safe. Wear a mask. Wear Please. A God damn it, just, wear a mask. Just be nice. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> this is Less Than Zero. Less than